Yo guys, we got some right up back when I was Red Dead Redemption 2 video. Last one that tough well we uh help we if you guys want to know who just go and check out the last video. But anyway, it's not busy chatting, let's get on to it. Now I can finally see what host do what Jose and what Jose. Hmm, I wonder if we can complete this entire map, you know. Anyways, no fish it, let's go on to it. Crap. Huh, ah, the dead eye's been increased. Yeah, let's get you out of there. How'd you end up in this? There you go. Thank you. God damn these bastards. Get out of here. Before any more of them come along. Okay. I'm not you think here if you want them. Well, guess I'm one of the good guys. <laughs> Thanks again, citizen. Let's get out of there. <laughs> my fucking god. Oh my. Let's go. Hey fellas, I have a meeting with Mrs. Braithwaite. My associates are already here. All right, that's enough. Move along now. Man, this is fancy. This way, sir. Thank you. A gentleman to Sean. see you, ma'am. Sean, how's there? friend, the other liquor vendor. Hello. Hello, ma'am. Arthur, welcome. We were just playing cribbage. Arthur Morgan, Mrs. Catherine Braithwaite. Nice to see you again. Apparently. So this one, he is big and as dumb as he looks? <laughs> well, he's surely big. But his intelligence is a matter of some conjecture. Some say he is as dumb as he looks, but I think, well, he's not quite that dumb. So these are the boys going to Caligar Hall? 
Yes, we can take care of that for you, but one hates to be coarse. There is the question of money. <laughs> oh, we've got money, Mr. Matthews. Paper, bonds, metal. <laughs> she ain't gonna pay you in a certified check, you Yankee numbskull. Ain't childbirth just the most beautiful miracle on earth? Seems a lady can birth monkeys, after all. Let's roll. What are we, supposed to, what are we doing? Drive? No. Yeah, sure. <sighs> Onto the thief. All right, let's get this over with. What are we doing? You were squatting there. Took everything I had. That son of hers. I'll shove that silver spoon down his throat <laughs> and pull it clean out of his ass. A smoke fucker. <laughs> I love this guy. <laughs> He's so funny. She wants us to torture tobacco fields. Really? Well, they did say that. Using that back there. Moonshine. Burns faster than kerosene, that stuff. Said it'd be fitting, she did. Not only thinking it's. And they think it'll be the great and we need the bright plates. No, just not yell, bitch. Jose really picked the right fella for tea at the manor, didn't he? Mm-hmm. Ah, he was giving his usual flannel. One of these families got ghost stashed somewhere. The more I spend time with them, the more I like so the more I love Jose and, and Sean. There really better be some bloody money at the end of all this. Jose knows what he's doing. Does he though? The master finagler of nothing. Easy, easy. He sounds so far, just like we've destroyed the break weight still. Try to sell the shine back to them. Now we're on this fool's errand, which I'm very much looking for. Now my honor's increased up significantly. They were saying old man Gray's double security after that business at the saloon. We just robbed their horses too. That was you? Jesus. Do they know us? So Do they know it was us? We're just gonna drive on in there, is that it? Don't worry, I got a plan. Wagons go in and out of there all the time with supplies, equipment, payroll. Especially now they're taking on all that extra muscle. We're making a delivery. That's all. Oh. Just leave it to me. I can talk a dog off a meat wagon. <laughs> all right, then. Yeah. Oh wait, they will recognize Arthur. You're not worried about them greys. In what sense? Well, they know you. Yeah, maybe you're right. I'll hide in here. You know what? Here, I'll go hiding back. If you can act naturally, stop us from getting into a fight before we're ready. I will try. Yes. Try and do an impression of a human being. I'm not going to go that far. <laughs> Boy. I've, uh, I've, there, there was a thing, a, a, a thing, at the saloon. What you talking about? Well, I'm delivering the supplies. You're not the usual driver. Uh, you want a bottle, friend? Here. Uh, uh, have a wee drop. <laughs> I'm new. I, I mean you no harm. <laughs> I, I've come from Donegal, in, in Ireland. You don't say. Yeah. <laughs> They said you'd understand uh, some kind of incident at the saloon in town. I, I was told to bring this up here. Ask no questions, I'll tell you no lies. Uh, sort of business. Uh, uh, before the officials got there, okay. they said. Okay. 
Drive this way. I'll show you how to get there. Oh, thank you, friend. Uh, have a drink. Sean. <coughs> Hamish. Good to meet you, Hamish. <laughs> uh, fine bit of country you've got here. Uh, not as fine as Connemara, but fine nonetheless. My people come from Scotland. Is that right? And you and I are nearly brothers. What's he got to you, Hmm. Just over here. Yeah, it's straight down the path here. It's getting so I can barely keep track of all these deliveries coming in. Yeah, when they said they was looking for more drivers in town, I jumped at the chance. I never been a feller to kick a bit of honest work out of bed. <laughs> so, you folks been having a hard time of it, have you? Yeah, Mr. Gray's got a heap of problems right now with another family around here. Bunch of covetous lowdowns trying to sabotage his livelihood. Disgusting. Oh dear, oh dear, I'm sorry to hear that, Hamish. Sounds like you definitely deserve that drink. <laughs> you don't know the half of it. Just in there. Ah, right you are. <laughs> you can unload it here. In here? Oh, <laughs> the horse is like a, a swift one, <clears throat> do they? <laughs> Excuse me? Um, nothing. It's grand. <clears throat> a quiet place you yeah. boys have got here. <laughs> Reminds me of one of them big houses there, uh, out in Donegal. Huh. Real fancy place as they was, Hamish. Real fancy because if some folks got all the money, they can build quite that fancy. Bye bye. <clears throat> Sorry. Time to like that guy, but oh well. Do the calls. Good. So we got these things ready. What are you working on? Okay. And how long did it take for them to make? I thought no one recognize us. Well, they won't recognize you. Here's how I feel we should deal with things. You head over to the dry barn. Sure. And you? I'm gonna deal with the fields themselves. We coat everything in moonshine, and then we light things up with these little fellas here. Thankfully, it ain't rained, and that old barn over there should go up like a torch. <laughs> How many of these boys you think you need? They should do it. Let's head out the back. Look, once they get wind of us, There'll be no turning back, so move quickly. Of course. I'm rebel stock, boy. I was born born in down manor houses. We'll burn quietly. Let's roll. Quiet. There's someone coming on the left. Extra bonus. Sure. I like it. You hear that? Payro. Yeah. Let's get this job done first, okay? Just let me deal with our friend here. What? You douse the fields, I'll meet you at the barn. Let's see ya. Stay out of trouble. That's good. Alright, next. 
It's good for here. I got it. Sean, where are you? Sean? Sean? Oh wait, oh wait, wrong one. I'll keep, I'll keep an eye out. Let's roll. Bye bye Terry for you own. This is becoming chaos. Come in, Sean. And we take the money as well.
How's cash? Bye-bye. So you better give us money for this. I thought we got the payroll of it, so that's sweet. I can see from here. What's the money we got? Oh my goodness. 212. Now it's sucking. This is bonus. This is bonus. This is brilliant. What does Michael want now? I'm also going to go get some sleep. Alright, Michael, what do you want? Wait first. Oh, it's robbery. Wait, until he's part of this? Let me see this. But first I'll do this, and I'm going to go and see what Michael wants. It better not turn into another shooter, because if it is, I am going to kill him. Hey, Bill, what you got? Hello, Arthur. Oh, wait, wrong one. Sorry, sorry, Charles. Hey, Bill, what you got? What are you doing? Prepping for a robbery. 
Which one? Had a good run of luck recently. Okay. Robbed a house up in Roanoke Ridge. Ooh. Robbed a couple of drunken soldiers out near the swamps. <laughs> Damn. What are you about to do? A stage. <clears throat> well. Again. Good luck. Well, do you want to come with me? Eh. I was going to ask Sean, but he's too much of a hothead. What's the opportunity? A bank stage. And without much security. This feller was telling me about it a couple of nights ago when we was drinking. It's gonna be coming right through, and the bank records the cost of security ain't worth the risk. Now there'll be a couple of guys, but nothing too serious, and lots of money. Easy money. Well, that's always the dream of every thief. <laughs> Easy money. Well, like I was saying, my luck is in now. Ho, ho, ho. Well then, why? Let's do it. Who are you taking? I think we need a girl. See, I got a plan in mind. Well, in that case, Tilly, you free? We got some work. Wait, I thought Karen would be the first option for this. Oh well, I want to see what can I do. Come Robin. Sounds good. Let's do it. Are you actually? Have you robbed anything? I mean, not not that I'm judging you because you're a woman. I just want to make sure. Okay, follow me. Yes, there's a good spot where we should be able to cut it off northwest of Dewberry. Perfect. You did, did you do your prep work? Sound, Bill. After that mess with the Cornwall stage, I wanna make sure we're not riding in another army. Yeah, speaking of that, is this is this uh yes, stage is this a coach by a Cornwall or not? I was a little womanly distraction. I figured that much. But what's the story? Route, number of guards, you know, important details. I like your thinking, Just Tilly. Exactly what I say and you'll I've done all the groundwork on this. Next time she brings in a lead of her own, we'll all bow down, I promise. I'll remember you said that. <laughs> you follow orders, you stay alive. That's what they used to tell me in the army. They kicked you out of the army. They did not. I beg to differ, Marion. <laughs> I like this girl. You shouldn't have left it out. Oh, really? Really? I thought you were going to go past that. Sorry, people. Sorry, Tilly. You shouldn't have left it out. Can you believe this, Morgan? I don't trust her any more than I trust that Kieran boy. Hey, Kieran's fine. Running with them foreman boys all them years. Who are the foreman boys? Any minute. Just shut your mouth or I'll shut it for you. You have no damn clue. <laughs> all right, just take it easy, you two. Get your minds on what matters. Do this right. What? <laughs> <laughs> You sure that's not Cornwall stage, Bill? I do not want to run, never run in with him. After that running we had him with Valentine. We do not want too many feet. We are good. Okay, so what do we do? Hey, Tilly, you know what to do here? All right. So the stage should and be why is it raining right now? What you want me to do? Just act dumb and silly and get the thing stopped. You know, like ah. And what you mean by that? That's because she's a woman. That doesn't mean she's not capable of doing something, okay? I mean, she's not capable of doing the robbery. Mr. Williamson. In fact, I think you're an obnoxious idiot. <laughs> I didn't say nothing to you. I really like this girl. Half man, what does that even mean? <laughs> you two stop arguing. He started it. Yeah. Here's a goddamn stage coach. What do we do? Wait. Do yes. Come on, both of you, follow me. What's the plan? There's been a change of plan. Oh, for God. You act dumb and get them to stop. 
You, do you know how to use a gun, Teddy? Oh, wait, I'm on. We, we deal with this then. Oh, well. What the hell is happening? What just happened? All right, so the stage should be coming from over there. What you want me to do? But you just act dumb and silly and get the thing stopped. You know, like. And what you mean by that? Get all precious and stuck up on me now. I don't like your manners, Mr. Williamson. In fact, I think you're an obnoxious idiot. Did you say to me? I didn't say enough to you, you useless half man. <laughs> half man? Half man? What does that even mean? Will you do stop arguing. He started it. Here's a goddamn stagecoach. We're doing this? Yes. Come on, both of you, follow me. What's the plan? I'm on it! Alright, speed demon, go as fast as you can, boy. First time I jumped onto a wagon. Oh god, oh god, oh god! There we go. You take the honors, Arthur. Grab the loot from inside. Yeah, I can. Damn, it's locked. Hold on. Let's blow it up the Don't bank. Stand back. That's what I said. How do I do this again? How do I... Uh oh! Run! Oops! We made a right mess of that. We stopped it, didn't we? Yeah. After chasing it all over New Hanover, but God knows who watched. Let's split up, get the hell out of here. Okay. Where's Tilly? Don't think I'll forget. I know, I know. Go on. Need to get my honor back up. I'll see you back in camp. 300, nice. Yeah. 
Alright, let's go to Micah, see what he wants. After this, I'm gonna go into end this video. Everybody. It goes too late. Yeah. I should really get my honor up. I'm gonna see how, what on earth I need to do. I don't know. That's another man, that's another thing. Ah, might as well do it. See what this is all. Wait, I'm gonna wait until noon. Until morning, I mean, you wanna see this is what this can do. It was right here. Oh god. Anyways, I'll go in the, you know. I'm gonna go to noon and see when it unlocks. Head out. Alright, Tilly. Good luck on today. We do nothing. Anyways, I'm gonna see what's. I'm gonna go and do that again. First, let me go to morning. See what happens. Chose Ryan Spelling. Oh, 
Hold on. I think it's this might not be on my call. I'll go and do the mission after. Micah, what you got now? Blessed are the peacemakers, for they shall be called. Hey, hey? what are you talking now? about? However it goes. I'm not sure all that line of thought serves you and me very well. Uh, that's because, Cowpoke, you are a man of profoundly limited intelligence. No doubt. Well, you and the old man and Dutch have been running around, digging us ever deeper into shit. Old Mr. Pearson might have gone and lightened the load a little. Pearson! Whoa. Ain't you curious? I guess. Gentlemen. Dutch, you tell him, fat man. It's peace, no. Dutch. The Adriscals. What? I, mean, I think there's a way. What on earth are you talking about? Get the words out properly, fat man. Don't fat shame me, Micah. Rude. On the road in the town, things were about to get ugly. But you know how I am in a fight, huh? Like a corner tight. <laughs> Very anyway, funny. Somehow it didn't, but we got to talking, and they suggested a parlay to end things like gentlemen. Gentlemen. Really? Are you mad? Have you lost your minds? You're always telling us, Dutch. Do what has to be done, but don't fight wars ain't worth fighting. They want a parley? It's a trap. Mm -hmm. Of course, it's probably a trap, but what do we got to lose finding out? Bring on the backup we got. You ain't getting shot because you'll be protecting us. It's a trap. You shoot a lot of them. If it ain't a trap, that's slim chance. I don't see the point in any of this. Me neither. It's a chance. You've got to take it. Hosea, what do you think of all this? I killed Combs' brother a long time ago. Mm-hmm. Well, wow, how? What's the full? Why'd it cost you to do that, anyways? Don't. Killed a woman I love dear. I'm sorry. Mm. As you say, it's a long time ago, Dutch. Some things may never go away. Don't let that. Don't Dutch is the trap. Let's go. You and me, with Are you mad? Us, no one else. What about me? This ain't the time for tigers, my friend. Fine, can we at least bring back up with us a lot of backup? Because I feel like this is going to be a capture mission. I mean, a rescue mission. Uh, fine. I do not That's like the sound of this. Morgan. Let's go then. Why even cause? Uh, I've been fighting Comb for so long now, I can barely remember a time when it was different. And you're still fighting him now. Make no mistake of that. Here he goes, Downton Thomas. Is there any plan you ain't sour on? Well, uh, maybe you're right. Just nervous. Let's not waste any more lives needlessly. Mm -hmm. I ain't costing lives here. I'm saving them. Really? What did you say? That, was, that one was that message back in Strawberry, huh? Of yeah, a call that you did, if I'm correct, because Jose said that you were the one who wanted to go on that ferry that caused and the whole thing to happen. Then it, then who knows when this local hillbilly thing will come to a head? Hmm? And we really I still do not like this guy. On all these fronts. And O'Driscoll. There is wisdom in that. Uh, I hope so, gentlemen. But like I said, I'm nervous. Look. You ain't even going to be the one in danger. We'll get on over there, find a nice perch for you to settle into. You got that rifle, don't you? Yeah. yeah Why? Yeah. And me and Dutch walk right in to the lion's den with you to cover us. <laughs> okay. Just keep calm. Unless I give you a reason not to. Oh, we'll be fine. We got you. I will do my best. Oh, my dear and trusted friend, with you watching over me, I would walk into hell itself. As would I. Hey, up there, men on the ridge. Careful. Driscoll's from the look of them. Uh, don't like having 
got eyes on us. We're close. You'll be the eyes soon enough. Maybe he's right, Dutch. Maybe I have pushed too hard. You got us. Well, if I recall correctly, you got us into fairy jobs. Then that whole mess of strawberry. I seriously do not like this dude. There's no such thing. This is horse shit from both of you. Mm-hmm. Micah might be full of shit. Como Driscoll might be full of shit. The promise of this great nation. Man created equal. Liberty and justice for all. That might be nonsense too. But it's worth trying for. It is worth believing in. Can't you see that, friend? I don't know. Try. All I ask is you try. All right, cowpoke. You're going to peel off up ahead. We'll be meeting down on the plane. Fine. Just above us where you can keep an eye on things. All right, all right. Okay. However this shakes out, let's aim to meet back at the fork in the road afterwards. We'll be there, partner. Yeah. My oh, guys on Dutch, things are going good. Where are they? Where's Cornwall Driscoll? First time I mean this guy. Why in between him and his brother? I mean him, Dutch and Corn's brother. Oh, here we go. Hello, Dutch. It's been a while. Sure. So, uh, how's your gang doing? They still believing in you? Better world. Pure world. Hmm? How's that coming along? Just fine. Mm. How's that score you stole off us? Which one? <laughs> oh, I like that. It's like I said, this is a charismatic leader. Sounds like it's not going well. A lot of heat on us this time. Both of us. Whole heap of trouble. They offered me a price, Dutch, to bring you in. Why didn't you take it? Well, still might. I am sorry about your brother. Yeah, well, I never liked him much. I liked Annabelle. I always love the ladies, Dutch Vanderlyn. I like that about you. What are we doing here? Go home. Is this thing over? What the <laughs> shit? Son of a bitch, it was a setup. No, not the Dutch, they're after Arthur. Crap. We've been captured! Oh, fuck. Alfred? I don't know. Column's got a sense. Handing him over to the lords. I don't know. Strange times. They killed Seamus. Fucked the whole lot of them. Let's get out of it quickly. Uh oh. Da! Shit. Uh oh. Dude, we just got shot. We just got shot. Shit. Son of a bitch. I knew. I should have known it was a setup all along. Finally, 
got his weapons over there. We have been set up. Crap. That's brilliant. And we've been captured. Arthur Morgan. It's good to see you. Uh, hello, Cole. <laughs> How's it going? I hardly feel it. You will. <laughs> Septic. Nice. Now, tell me. Fine gun like you. We need to get out of there. Still running around with old Dutch. Could come ride with me and make real money. It ain't about the money, Cole. No, no. It's Dutch's famous car. Uh, uh, you killed a whole bunch of my boys. Six point cat. I ain't got no clue what you're talking about. Oh, you lie, my friend. Then I thought Dutch preached truth. Let me go, Cole. And end all this crap between you two. We all got real problems now. The way I see it, they get him. They forget about me. They ain't the forgetting sort. If I were you, I'd run as soon as I had the money. <laughs> oh, I know you would. Let's see. We lure an angry Dutch in to rescue you. Grab all of you, hand you, then disappear. So you only met with him to grab me? <laughs> of course. He gonna be so mad. He gonna come raging over here. And a whole lot of it. And the law be waiting for him. Arthur. <laughs> Arthur. I missed you. Son of a... We get out of here. How? Perfect. Got it. Let's get out of here. What do we do now? Whoa, whoa, whoa. I'll fight. Oh, we need to deal with that then. Ooh. Jesus. Oh, that's gonna leave a mark. What? How is this going to help us? How is this going to help us? Cauterized ruined? Oh. Uh-oh, it's opening. I don't want to go to Mexico. I want to go home. Home. Hold on, I'll be back in a minute. And you won't be able to see home. We need to get out of here. What's he still doing down there? It's one thing torturing a man, it's another thing putting him through stories of the homeland. You better hurry it up. I don't want to be here when the law comes for that side of beef.
First more weapons. Oh, there we go. That's better. Ah, oh, thank God. Come on, sweetie, man. let's get out of here. We need to get back home. I mean, get back to camp. I think it's best if, best, if, best if we don't take the main road. Rear. Perfect. Hopefully they won't be able to see us. I hope, I hope horses can swim in water. But this is a good, a nice rinse for you. Don't lose your stamina, don't lose all your stamina yet, boy. There we go. Let's get out of here. There we go. <sighs> Next time, whatever, when there's a mission that has Mike in it, do not enter it. I do not trust that dude one bit. Seriously. Oh my god, that was so hectic. Arthur. We got a problem. Arthur? Dutch! We've been set up! I told you it was a setup, Dutch. My boy. My dear boy, what? What do you think? We were kidnapped. 